What's going on everybody? This is JR here, JR Tech 3 back with another video. In today's video, we will be unboxing an iPad Pro. Now this is the 12.9 inch in space gray. They do have silver as well. This is the 256 gig version that I got. Um, they also have a 128 gig, 256, 512, and one terabyte. All right. Uh, they also come in two different models, the one Wi-Fi model and the Wi-Fi and cellular. This is the Wi-Fi and cellular. As I told you before, y'all know I'm with Verizon, so this is the one that I decided to rock with because uh, Verizon's been very kind to me. <laughs> so in the box, you get the iPad Pro, of course, a USB-C charge cable and an 18 watt USB-C power adapter. Let me repeat, for 2020, in the 18 watt USB-C power adapter. Enjoy it while you can. All right, for the display, you got a 12.9 inch liquid retina display. Uh, that's gonna be 264 pixels per inches. All right, true tone display, fingerprint resistant, fully laminated display, 600 nits brightness, all right? So as far as performance is concerned, you're gonna have a chip that's gonna be an A12Z. Bionic chip with 64 bit architecture neural engine. Alright, uh, also for the camera, you got a wide angle lens for 12 megapixels with one f1.8 aperture, an ultra wide lens with 10 megapixels, f2.4, and 125 field of view, two times optical zoom, digital zoom up to five times. Alright. And a whole bunch of other features pretty much like the iphone maybe just a few less and that's pretty much it so without further ado let's go ahead on and get into this unboxing i will say this is my first ipad so pretty excited about it all right so again show sure you got the 256 gig 12.9 inches the fourth generation wi-fi and cellular in the space gray color all right, so I'm really looking forward to this, so let's go on and get into it. Got that tab right there, that's nice. All right, slap that on the side. Okay, here we go. This is always very satisfying feeling right here man because you know it's apple so it's going to put that to side and now we just got this whole piece of look at that all right so we got the ipad right there let's go and put that to the side real quick we got some books and stuff designed by apple in california let's see all right so we got our regular books Got some stickers. I'm actually holding on to these stickers, man, because uh, I don't get stickers no more. Alright. Also, you got your USB C to USB C charging cable right here. Definitely gonna hold on to that. And this right here. Whew, man, it's a diamond in the rough right now, y'all. We got an 18 watt power adapter USB C. Definitely gonna be holding on to this because well, drop test right there. Everything's still good. Definitely gonna be holding on to that because uh, we ain't getting those in the box no more, unless you live in Brazil. All right, so that's everything in the box. Let's go on and put this to the side here. And let's take a look at this beauty. Now this is amazing right here to me, man. I've never had an iPad before, so this is this is nice. Hold on, let me take that back. I have had an iPad. I had an iPad Mini. It was a long time ago. All right, man, here we go. Got that new camera module on the back. The two. Got That's nice. That is nice. All right. Got that fullness there, Rev. Cool, cool. That's beautiful. And it's light, too. It's a lot lighter than I thought it would be. Some real big speakers on the bottom there. Okay, okay. Volume buttons over here. We got uh, 
power button up here on the top sim card right there all right let's go on and power this thing on see how much juice we got do we have any juice i know it's been cold there we go yeah yeah that's nice all right man so while that's loading up i'm gonna go on and say i have uh this case right here it's a uag um metropolis uh metropolis series case right here that we're gonna be trying on uh, i do want to get some more cases uh, this case right here it's just it's one that i've really been wanting i mean y'all know uag man they make some great cases real good quality stuff so we're gonna go on and slap that on after we get this thing set up and with that being said, I'm going to go on through this setup process and I'm going to get back with y'all in a hot second, all right? Holla at y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, so we got everything set up. It took me a little while because, hey, I'm going to be honest with you, I haven't had an iPad in I don't know how long and I tried doing the restore from my iPhone. And uh, I mean, it, it did it. it, except it just, it, for some reason, the backup from my iCloud came from my 11 Pro Max the day that I changed everything over to the 12 Pro. So, um, I mean, it's just like earlier this month, uh, well, earlier, um, about a month ago. So, I mean, everything is still, you know, coming in pretty much whatever. But anyway, we got everything set up. So, uh, just one thing I wanted to compare real quick, man, is just the size of the iPad. So I, I got the phone here, and I um, also have that right there. That's crazy, isn't it? That looks good. But anyway, I just wanted to show a size comparison, just trying to show you like the thickness. I have a screen protector on this, by the way, just in case y'all was wondering. Um, and it's looking like the i the phone is actually a little bit thicker than the iPad. That is crazy to me. Um, I don't know, man. I mean, technology is just amazing now in 2020. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to show y'all that real quick, man. And I just can't get over how light this thing is. So, I'm gonna open it up. Uh, based off of what I'm seeing right now, it's ridiculous how fast this thing is. Um, like I said, man, this is, I'm new to the game. I'm new to the iPad game for 2020 and uh probably since what what was it maybe 2013 14 since i had an ipad yeah it's been a minute man so this is good right here man um i'm excited to use it i'm excited to try out all the different features uh one thing that i did forget to mention was that this has a 10 hour battery life and that's just based off of you know like regular um, if it's connected to Wi-Fi and like web surfing and stuff like that, but I'm sure like if you really really use it hard It'll die pretty quick probably Moving on to the next thing Of course we have to have something to protect it with so Got the case right here. It's a case by UAG. It's a Metropolis series So let's go and get into it A magnet now if you want to get one of these uh, I'll leave a link in the description to where you can buy it from if you want to buy it online me I just actually went to Best Buy and got it and I was lucky enough to find a black case so um, let me see let me just give y'all some features real quick all right so it's for the iPad Pro 12 inch fourth generation 2020 but it also fits a 12.9 inch uh, third generation from 2018 as well impact resistant traction grip auto wake and sleep adjustable stand uh, apple pencil charging uh, slash pairing compatible you get a one year limited warranty on this design in california so apple and them probably talking uh but anyway so that's pretty much it oh one thing i will say that that it does have in the disclaimers here is that it's not compatible with the smart keyboard folio it's not compatible with the magic keyboard all right if you had a second gen it doesn't it does not work device and pencil are not included sometimes it's, uh, some people might even know that anyway all right here we go uag metropolis series i like this case i like how it feels 
It's like a, a real rubbery, you know, it's got a grip to it. I like that. I need, I need that. I need that. So let's go on and open it up here. All right. Take that out. And we're just going to go on and pop this thing in. This is huge. This is absolutely huge. Eh. Eh. I know I ain't the only one that struggles with this. Ah. Okay, hold up. We ain't doing that. Not right now. Okay, that might be a reason. It's upside down. Okay. Let's try this again. One side here. For the next series of stuff that comes out, y'all know I'm going to have this right next time. Right. It'd be nice if this thing came with some instructions on exactly how to how to put this on. Alright, angle level's increasing just a tad bit. We almost there though. We almost there, yo. Oh, this has gotta be an easier way. Ah, okay. Boom, boom. That's not fully, let's see, make sure that's fully on. on from the bottom, all right. All right. Okay. All right, so we got the back on. Boom. So that's how that fits. So if we're looking at everything, we got our cutouts up here. This speaker grill isn't quite lined up like I think it should be. But we got that speaker grill over there. So you got your slot for your pencil right here. Okay, speakers, cutouts, everything. All right, and then we open it up. All right, so if you wanted to fold it back like so well so basically I'm assuming that you're just gonna sit it like this Boom. my only gripe with it the magnet the magnet feels real lax real lax like that it, it just don't really seem like it wanna like it, it don't seem like it's doing right you feel me but I mean, it is cool that you can have it, you know, sitting however, you know, that's cool. I like that. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and close this thing out. All right, y'all. So that's pretty much it. Um, I like it. I like it. It's going to take some getting used to as far as the size is concerned because I've only been using iPhones and my MacBook. Uh, but I'm really excited to get into, you know, the different features and try out different stuff with it and everything. But if you like the video, hit the thumbs up button. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you got any questions, of course, you know, I'll get back to you. Um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you liked, uh, liked everything. And, man, I will see y'all in the next one. Of course, I'm gonna check out some more cases. And we definitely got more iPhone content coming very, very soon. In the meantime, y'all make sure y'all stay safe out here in these streets. I'll holler at y'all in the next one. Till next time, peace.